Hey, this is Stacy from Let's Cook Y'all. Welcome back to our channel. If you're new, welcome. We're really glad you're here. This is a feature we're doing every week, a grocery haul, a meal plan, maybe, and a question of the day. So I'm sitting in the parking lot at my Kroger. I just ate a snack, so I would not be so hungry. I'm gonna try to get a few things and I'll show you hopefully a small haul when I get back and some ideas for menus. We got something else going on this week and be sure to stick around for a question at the end. I don't do it very often, but I stuck to my guns. I have an extremely small Kroger haul. What you don't see here is the items we're gonna swing by Sam's Club this weekend and get. Tim is back on his I Just Want Salads kick. So we're gonna give a week of salads, for the most part, a try. Um, I did get my juice that I get every week at Kroger. I got some buttermilk to make some biscuits for Tim. The cheese is on sale at my Kroger for $1.88 a bag. What you don't see here that I wanted was eggs. Uh, I think every year that I, as long as back as I can remember, Kroger puts eggs on sale for, for Easter, for dying and for making deviled eggs and all kinds of fun things with eggs and they're not on sale. They were $1.59 for a store brand dozen and $2.38 for a store brand 18 count and I refused to buy them. So I got a couple of coal things, mostly produce, we are gonna go buy the big thing of lettuce at Sam's this weekend for a lot of salads, but I got this butter lettuce. I'm gonna probably do lettuce wraps next week. The sweet potatoes are on sale at my Kroger. The blueberries are on sale at my Kroger. I got some carrots, zucchini, tomatoes, and a cucumber for salads. The tomatoes are for Tim, the cucumbers for me. The pineapples are also on sale at my Kroger, although they were $2. I much prefer them where they're 99 cents, but I do love pineapple. I got a cheap loaf of bread for Tim, and I was trying to keep it below 20 or 25. I would have done that had I not found two things on clearance that decided to hop themselves right into my cart and come home with me. The first is a marinated pork tenderloin for $3.49. That's over a pound of meat, so I thought that was a pretty good deal, and that's a nice thing to have in the freezer if I need to take a meal to someone that's sick or been in the hospital, or I just don't feel like cooking for the two of us. And I rarely find decaf coffee marked down, and we both really like Green Mountain. I checked on the regular aisle. These bags are on sale for $6.99, so that's seven bucks, so $3.50 is half price. And I drink only decaf, so Tim, Tim drinks some at night, so that was a pretty good deal. Only reason I went over. I've got a few menu ideas for you next. Sorry for the lighting, but uh, it's storming here. We've had some trees down and bad weather, and the menu for next week is very up in the air. Tim has declared again that he wants to have salad week, so we're going to pick up some lettuce Saturday or Sunday at Sam's. I've got some ideas. One thing I am gonna have is the lettuce wraps using that bib lettuce that I got at Kroger and then we will pick from some of these um, options for salad. And I've also got, I can't write anything, I'm still having trouble with my hand, so I've typed everything up. And I've got some ideas for pantry meals, I think I'm gonna switch back and do some more. Um, pantry meals for the rest of April and on into early May, I've got a page and a half of these, and I can actually cut and paste these over onto our blog our website if anybody's interested this is just using things that I have in my pantry and freezer so that's a few menu ideas for the week and we've got a question for you next this week's question is about Easter it's a big holiday in our house it's um, the most joyous day of the year for us it's also a big holiday for a lot of people as far as food goes I wanted to know if you have any fond memories about Easter whether they're food related or family related or anything you'd like to share. I love ham, so I love Easter. That's a traditional thing for me. Deviled eggs. Um, I like my pineapple casserole with ham. So if you've got any food related Easter things or a story, something that's happened to you, or did you grow up doing Easter baskets or getting to do new clothes or new dress or new hat or something for Easter, leave us a comment and let us know. So this week's question is all about Easter. Hope you have a truly joyous and blessed Easter weekend and have a wonderful day. We'll see you on the next video.